the afternoon, but I'm finally back in the studio. I've been doing quite a lot of other stuff today and I also have been recovering from migraine. So I haven't been feeling great, but I've been for a walk around the garden. I did about four and a half thousand steps. So it was a decent length walk, about two miles. And now I'm gonna get on with this. <music> It's now several days later and not much progress has been made as you can see. The reason for this is because I've also been working on other projects. I rarely work on just one thing at any one time so I haven't just been concentrating on this. I've also not been very well. I've had migraines this week. I've been in a real cycle of them. They'll go away for a bit and then they come back again. So I actually haven't been able to work as well as I normally would. And thirdly, I made these tree trunks too thick. So what I did is mix up some more of the background color and I basically have trimmed them down. So you can see they ended up looking like that after I trimmed them down and went over it with a couple of coats of the, the bluey gray color. And I'm just putting them back now. So this looks much better. It looks thinner, which is what I want. I want them to be tall and thin. And also I want them to not look too straight. They were just looking really too unnatural, I guess you'd say. So what I've done is I've added some little bumps and ridges and hopefully they're gonna start looking like proper trees. So I'm now filling those in. Um, this is the base coat. I always start with black. So I will be adding all of the colours and the shading on top of this and that's what I'm going to continue to do today. So I've been working on this for about another hour or so, not very long. Um, I didn't get to work on it until later in the day again. But yes, so what I'm going to do is, I'm getting a little bit impatient. I've been filling in the trees with black, just marking out their basic shapes. The one on the left, he's going to have a lot more branches, like little branches coming off. But what I'm going to do, just to move this on a bit and to keep things interesting for myself, because to be honest, it's a little bit boring just working in black. So I want some colour on here and I've decided that I'm going to start filling in the trunk with colour and layering that up and shading it so we can get more of a feel for how the trees are actually going to look. So I'm going to work on that. I was aiming to get the three trees marked out in black but um, I think that I'm just going to do this because it keeps it interesting and 
painting is meant to be enjoyable and sometimes with any painting you get to a stage where it gets a little bit tedious you get a little bit bored especially if you're like me and you're doing things in a very precise way so yeah I'm just going to go for it in here now because it's early afternoon I've been meaning to film for you but I keep forgetting so I'm getting so into doing the painting but there we go you can see that I've added some color and shading to the first tree there and then I went on and tried to concentrate on just marking out where the other trees are going to be so it's progressed I think quite a bit since I last filmed um, so I'm going to continue with that today and show you a bit more of the progress before I get back to my painting, I just want to show you this view out of the window here. Do you remember when I was filming the time lapse the other day? It didn't look green like this and now suddenly over the last couple of days, all of the leaves on that tree behind the tower there are coming out. And I think we can safely say that spring is here. So that's where I'm going to leave it at for today and for this vlog. You can see in these images that the second tree along is the one that is totally finished. So that will give you some idea of how the other trees are going to look. In the next vlog you'll see one of two things. Either this piece will be completely finished or it will have moved on significantly from the stage it's at now. As I said earlier I'm working on other things as well so I'll actually be sharing those with you in the next vlog. Thank you for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you again next time. Thank <laughs> you.